Hey guys, back at the Target here. I decided to do a quick video because I see they got some restocks here from um, my last video, which was the Black Friday 2020. So I just decided, I actually picked up some stuff. So I decided to uh, make a quick video here. So let's, let's check out some stuff, huh? All right, so I noticed that they um, finally stocked up the Bill and Ted Face the Music um, Blu-ray. So it looks here, it comes with a digital code for uh, $19.99. They got the DVD and they also got a triple feature Blu-ray for uh, $29.99. And I guess that all comes with uh, digital. And I also saw that they finally stocked up the uh, Blu-ray for the Godfather Coda. So I actually picked up a copy of that for $14.99. Decided to like treat myself a little bit. Never heard of this. Infidel. And uh, I think from the last time they still had the New Mutants in 4K and all that stuff. If they did have Bill and Ted, I don't remember. I don't think they did. So um, here's some other stuff. Misbehavior, Ava. I don't remember this stuff from like last time. Iron Mask, Panetta. Look, <sighs> got all my crap here. Uh, Tenant. I don't think they had Tenant last time. Not on sale, but I mean, it's here. So if you want to wait for a lower price, you could do that too. I'm not gonna buy Tenant. I saw it. I liked it. It's confusing, but I, I would see it again. Look at this junk. And then they had—they definitely had Mulan from uh, last time. So they also have uh, vinyl here, and um, you know they have—they have some stuff. Um, from last time, uh, some of the vinyls here. I remember uh, Beastie Boys and Queen. But as you see, there's um, Harry Styles there. You got Billie Eilish. That looks like Whitney Houston behind her. The Weeknd. I remember uh, Selena. I don't remember this here. The Stevie Nicks. I guess it's a two CD. I remember they made a um, they they did a documentary and. Uh, I actually wanted to go see it, but I missed it. So um, I'll have to look out for that. Anyone, uh, anyone see that? You know, I remember, um, I remember ACDC here, but I don't remember that Jimi Hendrix. And I saw they actually uh, moved some stuff in the front, um, Motown and stuff uh, for uh, Black History Month. So there's, uh, there's some stuff in the front for uh, Black History Month. So, I don't know too much about that. Um, so some of this stuff was here from last time and some of it is new. This stuff all looks um, familiar from last time so it's probably just uh, restocks. You see you got a uh, 10 bucks for Hustlers Blu-ray even though I don't see it in stock. 12 bucks for the way back. 750 for the last full measure. And then there's a buy two get one free going on. As signed. But I guess that's um whatever is uh here. Just buy two get one free. I'm actually looking forward to the uh, Godzilla versus Kong so I'm gonna uh, try to catch up on those movies because I I don't I, I would rather watch like the old um, movies from the 50s than watch um, the new stuff so some of this stuff was here last time friends and the Flintstones but I don't remember seeing um, the Lucy DVD I would buy it for like $19.99 um, so I'll have to like keep my eye out for that. Look at this. Um, so the Rob, but that's a DVD. So uh, yeah, I, you know some of this, stuff, some of the stuff was uh just like restocks and um. Oh, 
Okay, so like I've been looking for the um Beverly Hills Cop and Coming to America. Those will kind of be like blind buys for me. I don't remember those films like so much. Um, but I almost just want to blind buy them. Did anyone pick up the 4Ks of um, Coming to America and Beverly Hills Cop? So um, you got uh, Back to the Future, V for Vendetta, Total Recall. I think this is new, Total Recall. I don't think this was here for Black Friday. I'm not too sure. So they got part two of A Quiet Place coming out. I mean, it was all right, but not, not really like... I, I won't be running uh, to go see that. Um, yeah, I was just like bringing up Elle Fanning. Um, I like her, but I've never seen that. And, uh, you know, I didn't see this one either, but I like Shia LaBeouf. Okay, I, I don't know what that is. Cutthroat City is a film by RZA. Um, what was that last RZA movie? Oh, what the hell was it? Uh, the Man with the Iron Fist. <laughs> it, it, it wasn't too bad. I mean, what do you... What do you expect? You know, he just likes that, um, that, uh, Kung Fu stuff. I, I don't remember that movie too much, but I remember people, um, didn't like it. I think this was here last time. I haven't seen this yet. Did anyone see the new Woody Allen movie? I mean, I don't want to blind buy it, but I want to, um, see it. So what is it saying here? It says, buy two, get one free. DVDs, Trolls, War Two. Okay, so it has... DVD Doolittle. Okay, what did the other ones say? Um, Blu-ray combo. Uh, okay, Hobbs and Shaw, and then um, I still believe Aquaman. Um, John Wick Three. I would just want it for the cover, though. Um, okay, so that's what I wish they would do because, um, it seems like they started doing that for, uh, the Blu-rays. Well, look here. So you could kind of tell, you know, they got the black banner for the 4K, but that Total Recall one seems just like a little more, um, transparent. Like you can't tell it's a banner compared to like that. Like it's kind of ugly, right? Because it's just so black and I mean and I love black but like that looks better if you're gonna do the banner but um I'm into the no banners that they just finally started using their fucking brain you know you can't even tell with something like that now this was like $7.99 during um Black Friday So you see what I'm trying to say? And I noticed that with um, Unhinged as well. So they did it with Midway as well. But look, for Scoob, they didn't do it. They added that banner. Get rid of the banner, bro. Like, the people who are buying this stuff anyway know what the hell they're buying. Look, for Unhinged as well. Uh, Annabellum. Anyone see that yet? I like I like her. I like Janelle Monae. I like her music. And did anyone see this? All right, guys, I think that's really it. So I just wanted to make like a quick Target video. Oh, look. Okay, let me, I also finally grabbed the um, the rest of the Friday the 13th uh, action figures. I grabbed um, part two and part four. So look, uh, the final chapter. And then um, they got part two, so, you know. You always want to come here to get uh, the toys and All right, guys, I think I'm going to wrap it up here. Uh, go ahead and check out my other Target video, the Black Friday. Hey, guys, I'm just going to do a quick follow-up video after looking inside to see if Target restocked any of the 4K Blu-rays and stuff. But like I told you, I picked up some stuff, so I just wanted to show you that real quick. So first of all, I, I actually picked up for $14.99. I don't know if I got ripped off or not. For the Blu-ray of the Godfather Coda. And if I, maybe I'll... Maybe I'll just hang on to it. So if the price drops in like a month or something, I could do a, a price match or something. So uh, guys, check out the review I did on the Godfather Coda, the car review, kind of like this. Um, 
because I saw it in the theater and I already have the, fir uh, the first three Godfathers on Blu-ray so I don't know why I bought this but I bought it anyway and actually I'm waiting for the re-release on 4K I'm definitely gonna buy that and it better come with digital this comes with digital at least I don't have the first three films on digital just on disc and that's fine but I want it on digital so when they bring out the 4K they better put it on digital as well so I also told you that I grabbed the uh, Friday the 13th toys I already have a few at home but you know they finally restocked some of them at um, this location so first off it's Friday the 13th part 2 and look at this cover here it's pretty cool it's like uh, uh, this doesn't happen in the movie though this happens in part 3 kinda right it's supposed to be I guess adult Jason taking someone I don't know uh, I guess they could have, maybe they could have done without that, but I guess they wanted to make it a little more exciting because just the black silhouette is not exciting enough. It is for me, but you definitely are getting a uh, potato sack Jason with this one. So let me uh, open it up. Uh, these are usually like $29.99 or so. So uh, yeah, splurge, you know, just decided to splurge start 2021 off right uh so this comes with um potato sack this comes with him without a mask at the end of the movie and this comes with also a fire oh, oh okay it comes with like a campfire um i guess so you could uh, recreate that right there and it also comes with another oh that's the mother i was gonna say it comes with a guy's head <laughs> but that's mrs Voorhees. um at least it's supposed to be and that's what it says back here it includes machete pitchfork pick axe knife spear campfire pamela head and interchangeable jason heads. friday the 13th part two so i actually have what i have two three and i have four here and five i don't have one do they have toys for part one let me know guys it would just be uh boy jason and pamela right but uh I would probably buy it anyway if it looks good. So here's Friday the 13th, the final chapter. The goriest one. I like part two so much better than part four. But here's part four because this one is going to come with. It says here it includes machete, knife, axe, corkscrew, tombstone, hacksaw, cleaver, and two interchangeable heads and masks. I hope you guys can see it. If not, go to Target and check it out for yourself and put it in your hand. Or, you know, uh, make sure your Target is stocked with it first or just order it online, whatever. You know, I wasn't even planning on uh, buying this stuff. Okay, so it comes with a tombstone, like it said, machete, knife, and uh, the corkscrew for when he kills uh, Crispin Glover. Two interchangeable masks, a hack, a lot of fucking weapons here, so it's gonna look good. Alright guys, that's pretty much it. That's all I bought. And then I bought some stuff you don't care about, like uh, light bulbs and uh, cascade. It, you don't care about that. So thank you for watching this video. Go, Like I said, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, a thumbs down. Subscribe, comment, and share. And let me know what you found at Target uh, this month, last month. And I will see you in the next video.